right, give it up for Femi and Harold Patrick! All right, gentlemen. Who wants to go first? Who wants to go first? Oh, me. Uh, what, Femi? Femi? Femi, Femi? Yeah, Femi's going to go first. Here we go. You guys know the drill. Back to the front. Three, two, one. Yes. Yeah. Harold is like Slender Man. <laughs> e except his superpower is HIV. <laughs> his, his superhero name is uh, Gay Man. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. You know, I can't. I can't exactly tell where Fami's accent is from. Um, all I can tell from his accent is that he's been dropped on his head. Uh, <laughs> Guys, I'm from China. <laughs> <laughs> and I would like to be in Amy's vagina. <laughs> <laughs> you can use a nail clipper to cut off Harold's dick. I uh, I am uncircumcised, so if y'all can, <laughs> can help me out a little bit, uh, no. Yeah, Femi will joke he's from he's from China or Taiwan. You know, he's clearly not. He's clearly not. He's clearly from a place with a lot of retarded people. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I and Harold are from the same place. Harold looks like a woman, which is why he has a very punchable face. The, the only... The only reason Femi moved to America is because he ran out of women to harass in Nigeria. <laughs> not, a lot of, not a lot of people know this, but Femi is actually the one who gave the mosquitoes AIDS. Um, <laughs> it's an interesting fact. Yeah, the mosquitoes were asking for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the only thing lower than Harold's IQ is is testosterone. <laughs> Wait, do that one more time. I didn't. I wasn't. Listening. <laughs> nice. He's not paying attention to that. The only thing lower than Harold's IQ is his testosterone. No. Got you. <laughs> no, right. nice. Hell yeah, that was that was good. <laughs> Fucker. Uh, Femi uh, Femi runs an open mic. Uh, he also runs his fucking mouth sometimes. And uh, he's good at running. He's good at running things. The other thing he's good at running is uh, when he gets caught peeking through windows. So tell your mom I said hi. <laughs> My mom would have you deported. <laughs> yeah, I would love to go back to China. <laughs> Harold doesn't wear glasses so that no one realizes he shot Trump. Okay. Yeah, I'm the one who shot Trump. You look like the rifle. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Femi looks like the space bar on my keyboard. Um. <laughs> yes, because I have a long uh, deck. Uh, Harold only dates minorities, so long those minorities are minors. Oh, my God. Uh, uh, that was, no, I'll take that back. I'll take that back. That's all right. Femi, uh, Femi actually, uh, another reason he moved to America is because he found out uh, gay marriage is legal. <laughs> <laughs> he's, uh, he's, not, he's, he's not gay. He just wants to make it illegal again. Um, One more joke, guys. Right. Yeah, I moved because I want to get AIDS. Uh, no. <laughs> Harold is proof that white supremacy is a lie.
It's fair. It's fair. Uh, Femi's full name is Baba Femi Ukendayo. <laughs> I worked really hard to learn that, so you better fucking no. No, it's Baba Femi Ukendayo, which uh, it roughly translates to "He who follows women home." Um, <laughs> Femi! Wow! I want to wash my hands! All right, there we go. Give it up. You guys can fist pound. All right, there we go. I'm going to keep it going. Here we go. Brandon Keeper, I see you right there in the front. Hell yeah. Femi, you're a nut job. Uh, Femi, I don't know if you've ever wondered what your Uber driver does when he gets off work. Um, <laughs> I don't know who won, but I guess I have to pick who didn't lose. Uh, <laughs> Femi, you are a psycho. Uh, I'll say it again. Harold, I think, had the better jokes. Femi, you're just a crazy person. Uh, I got to go with Harold, though, for the jokes. Harold. Harold gets one. Harold gets one. Connor Mook. Yeah, that was my favorite battle so far. Give it up for these two. They're fucking... That was awesome. Um, hell yeah. A couple notes. Uh, Harold looks like he roofies girls, but has trouble carrying them to his car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think I got a car? Hey, it helps. <laughs> <laughs> no, Femi uh, is the Uber. Uh, he helps me. <laughs> um, Femi, uh, I thought you did a good job of I am the captaining Harold uh, on the comebacks. Uh, I thought the mosquitoes AIDS bit was so good, but Femi's rebuttal of just being like, yeah, I gave them AIDS was better. Um, and your space bar line was crazy. I'm going to give it to Femi and pass it down. All Thanks. right, here we go. One for Femi, one for Harold. It's in. Stephanie. Uh, well, first of all, you two are two of my favorite people uh, in the comedy scene and out. So, And also, they filled in last minute for a battle that dropped. So seriously, give it up for them. <laughs> they were supposed to be like a few months out, and they, they decided to jump in and fill in for us. So that's awesome. Um, God, you two, you little fucking twigs. Uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what to do with you guys. Um, Femi, you're like, I want to fit in her vagina. I'm like, yeah, you're the size of a tampon. Go for it. Uh, <laughs> you little fucking pervert. I uh, I do love you so much. I Damn, I, both of you guys had a really good comeback uh, intermittently. Um, <laughs> the rifle comeback was so funny. Um, but I think I'm going, oh, no, I'm going to give it to, I'm going to give it to Femi. I'm giving it to Femi. <laughs> Oh, very interesting. Two for Femi, one for Harold. Let's see if it goes to an audience vote. But Chris Grieco, what do you think? Yeah, this looked like the battle from two battles ago, but dehydrated. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was great. I mean, if Femi would say the most vile shit, and then he would laugh like a Bond villain. Oh, no, Mr. Bond, I want you to have AIDS. I, uh, that was a lot of voice for not enough laughing. But, um, listen, uh, Harold, your Trump comeback, your space bar joke, the follows women thing. You both look like you're too young to be here, but I'm giving it to Harold for the joke writing. Oh, here we go. Good job. Oh, my God. The, the panel has been split two for two, all right? But as it was in 2000, a dated reference, we have one hanging chat, and it's decided by you, the audience. You guys will decide who wins this battle. Who did you enjoy more? Please make some noise. Hold yourselves, but make, wait, wait. Make some noise if you felt Femi won that battle. Make some noise if you felt Harold won that battle. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner right here is Femi, all right? Give it up for Femi, give it up for Harold. Step in, give it up for both those gentlemen.